Let's look at flight, how it has changed over years. People have always been interested in flying. The first form of flying was in a hot air balloon. The balloon was invented by the Montgolfier brothers in 1783. The hot air trapped in the balloon causes the balloon to rise. And as it gets colder, it comes down. Where you go and how fast you go is up to the wind on the day. It wasn't until over 100 years later that the glider was invented in 1891. The glider was made from wicker and cotton and had no engine. It was 12 years later that the first plane with an engine was invented. The plane was invented by the Wright brothers in 1903. And the flight lasted for 12 seconds. Today, the longest non-stop flight lasts for 18 hours. The first flight was just over 36 meters. Compared with today when a plane can fly over 15,000 kilometers. Planes got better very quickly and by 1919 Olcock and Brown made the first non-stop flight across the Atlantic. The flight took 16 hours and they ended up crashing in Ireland. In 1927, Lindbergh was the first person to fly solo across the Atlantic. He flew from New York to Paris in 33 and a half hours. In those days, women didn't usually do the same jobs as men. But Amelia Earhart was a special woman. She learnt to fly and cross the Atlantic by herself in 1932 in 20 hours 40 minutes. In 1939 in America, the first ever mass-produced helicopter took its first flight. As planes developed, it became easier for people to travel. We could send letters around the world a lot faster. And we could get fresh food from around the world. Can you put the first flight on the timeline? Well done! Goodbye!